you saw me bringing down that little stove that was actually here upstairs on the first floor. Marino had this very good idea to just bring it down here and install it for the time being because like the new stove for over there I'm I'm was only going to purchase uh, in in spring probably they are going you know <laughs> they are going to yoga to do yoga on the terrace even in winter After Christmas I was the first to arrive back here, I mean the first of our people here in the end of the village. And then Anke and Martin came and also Chris with Breche, a friend of his from Holland, and his cousin Sylvia. <laughs> Since we are so near to the woods, we never saw anybody to take care of, of the wood. I mean, it's just too, too, too far, too big. Uh, for any community, I think, to send workers and really tidy that whole wood. So we kind of take care a little bit of those parts nearby the houses because uh, thinking about, you know, sometimes those very long dry periods, you know, like a fire could happen and well, it's probably maybe really a a small contribution but just to tidy a bit the wood and bring back at least the dead timber you know like dead branches or even trees
Ja. Also im September. Aber es wäre ein Druck, kriegt man was nicht. Oh, sorry. Also, ich hab's nicht schon gefällt. Yes. Multitasking. <lacht> <lacht> Und jetzt? Opala, Opala. Das ist ein schlechtes Handgelenk I am attacking those door frames, you know, like because the walls are really thick, it's, there is kind of like an, 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 a frame uh, around the door that now is still just the old stone walls, but that part I didn't even add the mortar because I knew I'm going to, to use those nice old boards that I prepare now chestnut boards and it's going to be a little bit of a patchwork and underneath that wood I'm going to insulate with my rock wool because I think that part around the, the doors or windows is especially sensitive because their cold air is easily coming in <laughs> 